One of the nice things about living in our community is the freedom of choice, and with all the craft breweries in town, there are a lot of choices these days. Cola 8 News Now's Paul Harris takes you on a tour of the only lager brewery in town and introduces you to the former school teachers that are helping run it. Joe Walsh and the Eagles might be playing in the background, but it was a different bird that gave an upstart brewery in Reno its inspiration. Pigeon Head came from a oil painting that one of the owners, good friends did. Pigeon Head Brewery is located in the old SPCA building on 5th Street. So you used to come here for a kitten, now you come here for a keg. <laughs> John Wilson used to teach 5th grade in Reno until his buddies convinced him to help run the only lager brewery in town. I really believe in what they're doing. It's a lager brewery, so we're really unique in that way. One reason lager breweries are scarce is the brewing process takes longer than ales, says the former music teacher turned brewmaster. We decided to put our put our time in and really spend a, a lot of time on just letting that beer mature and, and make a good clean beer. When you come into Pigeon Head Brewery, you notice there's not a lot of table space here. And John Wilson says that's actually by design. That's what a brewery does. It opens up people and it, it creates opportunity and friendships. Features aside, whether the place will do well or fail essentially comes down to the beer. I literally enjoyed every beer on the menu and that's something you don't find with most craft breweries. And that is music to the ears of Brian Holloway. It's very satisfying. You know, I get a lot of great comments back from people and uh, there's always room for improvement, but it's it's very satisfying. Paul Harris, Colo 8 News Now. Pigeon Head is hoping that area around 5th and Wells Street becomes known as the Brewers District with Under the Rose Brewing Company down the street and the opening of the Depot Brewery a few blocks away.